all right guys for kage here and welcome back to the brand new video here we are devil may cry peak of combat will be the topic uh on today's video i believe it's pretty clear by the title and the thumbnail there is no clickbait i am giving up on uh devil may cry peak of combat and I, on today's video i want to explain all the reasons and just do my final farewell to my whole community who watched devil may cry peak of combat content I believe most of you, even like 99% of you, will understand why I'm doing this. But I want to explain furthermore my actions and why I'm doing this. Plus, we're going to talk about my overall journey as a free-to-play player in Devil May Cry Peak of Combat. For the people who will ask for my, my account, I really grinded this account and I was free-to-play. So I want to sell it at the end of the day. This is against TOS, I guess. Uh, but I will, I will, I will talk about that on a Discord server. So if you're interested, you can join the Discord server. And don't worry, the price won't be insane or anything like that. Maybe, maybe even I might give away the account. I'm gonna see about that. I, I will think about this, but this is the situation. Okay. So why I'm giving up of, on the game? First of all, I want to say. To every single one of you, thank you so much for watching Devil May Cry Peak of Combat. I truly, truly enjoyed making the content, especially the new codes, the updates, the character introductions, the scam reroll summons, if you remember, remember them from the beginning. That video got like 30 to 40k views. And truly, truly, my experience by playing this game with you guys is phenomenal. But we are now at the point where I don't enjoy the game, where I'm not motivated to play the game, where I'm not even hyped when the new character drops. Uh, I just don't log in every day. I didn't even log in for weeks now. I did lately just cover the new characters and that's it. And at the same time, I don't want to fake my excitement. Because if I'm not excited about this game, then you won't be so much excited by watching my videos and I don't feel like faking it, although I could easily do that, but I won't. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I'm giving up. Second reason is the developers. I still don't respect them. Uh, they still didn't do that big changes what we all wanted to and we're talking about the brand new story. Uh, I know they're giving us the story for new characters, blah, 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 which is amazing. But at the end of the day, there is too much recycle content. There is same old, same old stuff for weeks and months and this and that. The anniversary is really close, uh, I would say. A um, few more months and we are there. So who knows? Maybe I'll decide to keep this account and wait for the anniversary. And might, I might appear on anniversary again. You never know about that stuff. But currently, right now, I just don't want to fake it. I just don't want to force myself to make this type of videos. I really, really regret they actually didn't add new story. They didn't add new special events, etc. Like I said, most of the time, it was recycled content. And at the end of the day, the third reason why I'm giving up, I don't see a great future in this game. Like, first of all, they're making less and less money okay more and more people are giving up more and more people are stressed about this game more and more people are complaining about this game and at the end of the day let's get real after solo leveling arise dropped this game started to drastically fall and that's a natural thing in the gacha gaming industry there is when the new better game drops many people drop those worst games and they proceed with the better new games and that is just like a natural environment in this type of games and it is all cool why did i give up what else reasons do i have i was full on free to play uh, in my opinion in this game even though many people would say yo it's full on pay to win yes it is more pay to win the than free to play friendly but it's not that bad for the free to plays if you know what you're doing, if you're managing your currency correctly, if you're saving the PD transfers and everything else, you could actually acquire all broken characters in this game. Now, the big problem they've done uh, while, I don't know, a few months ago, I, I cannot remember now. The time and me are not the best, okay? Uh, but what they've done, they started creating those uh, characters 
that you need crazy amount of dupes so they can actually work the, that is that was a big problem in this game and that's something that i personally hated as being free to play player in this game let's get real i didn't like it at all at all, at all okay now in this game we had some crazy characters like endless judgment virgil when i started playing the game uh I managed to get him from a single summon within like 14 summons. So I got extremely lucky and I got the most broken unit in the game that has been broken for a long, long time. Even today from the beginning, this is one of the most broken and most fun to use character in the game. Also, my favorite character is and the Judgment Virgil, Count Under Virgil and the legend seeker virgil i truly thought when i saw legend seeker and when i summoned him i truly thought bro you're gonna play this game again you're gonna enjoy this game again but that wasn't the case and i was disappointed i was like no rokage how you don't enjoy it anymore yeah well i cannot force it sometimes in life you have to let go uh, you have to let it go sometimes you don't have to force it sometimes just like take a break take a deep breath and move on i know we are talking about now games right but overall you can put that same example on many aspects of your life sometimes it's better to let let it go let it go one of the crucial things in life for sure so yeah it ended like this i i truly thought about this i truly thought about this should i make this video should i wait has like but i believe it was obvious i just didn't want to even re i just didn't even want to cover i did cover the introduction video but when the update dropped uh virgil mirage slayer is nothing special although that's not the reason why i gave up no i know that we already have many broken virgils so if we got one mid virgil it's fine at the end of the day you know it's not big of the deal but I don't know, I lost my passion for this game, I lost my interest for this game, and I just don't want to fake my videos to be excited about this game. Uh, I have a wonderful experience in this game, I cannot say nothing wrong about that, but at the end of the day, developers manage, or publisher, whoever, the, the, they manage the, the managing of the game, they created that unhealthy environment from the beginning even before the launch of the game okay so like one example and there are many there are many trust me but just one example content creators i, I didn't want to even enter the program so i didn't bother at all but some content creators were in a program where you can make money and they didn't pay they, they didn't get paid at all so first of all even before the actual official launch they already scammed the content creators Overall, I can give you one tip to all of the companies, okay? Don't scam content creators because it will backfire drastically. Uh, we content creators are so, and that's just reality. That's a fact, nothing else. It's not bragging, it's a fact. We really can impact the game in so many ways. We really can destroy the game even before the launch if you scam us if you have some shady practices and so on and so on and so on so we can impact the game in such a bad way that people won't play it most people won't play it um, and at the end of the day you will have much less lasting game for yourself so that's just one tip that i want to give to all companies although that is like one of the rare if not the only example i know where the content creators didn't get paid and they were scammed and that shocked me that's because it's a stupid move it's a really stupid move <laughs> truly uh so i don't know what, what, what they were doing the second big problem is they didn't add new story they were just recycling the content they didn't add new events i know they started doing something now but for me currently not so much interested to be honest not so much interested uh also one of the reasons why i gave up is the lack of time like currently now i have enough time to cover this game but in the month of december especially um i won't have time there'll be many new games that will be dropping that i already have the co cooperation with the companies and i'll be more focused on that 
Uh, currently now I even managed to get a few new cooperation with Chinese companies. One of them are X7 Game. As you can see, I uploaded few and there will be many more upcoming about certain... I'm just testing out the games on their platform. Uh, just downloading, showing you how to do it and that's it. Just purely having fun and I'm getting paid for it. So I'm super grateful that I can do this type of stuff for sure. And I'll be always grateful and I'll always say thank you. And without you guys, I wouldn't have nothing of that. I'm well aware of that. And yeah, massive respect. Hopefully me as a content creator, I'm good for you guys. Hopefully I have like... For me, the most important thing is that I have correct influence on you guys. Okay? Uh, not in a sense of playing so much the games, right? I do my best. I definitely improved so much when I started doing this, but I can definitely improve so much more. I still do the mistakes, but we're humans after all. And when you work, you make mistakes like everywhere. But I just hope that I'm a right influence to you guys. I just hope that I am not... I will use the hard word poison to your mind because there is many content creators uh, in the YouTube in the YouTube industry that is poisoning the minds of children especially. I won't even say the name because I'm not content creator for that, but I believe you know for who I'm talking about. And there is many others who is working with that same person. The biggest YouTuber the biggest YouTuber ever that disappointed me in so many levels. But I just don't want to say the name because it's it's not the right place. Uh, it's not the right place. I might take and make another channel and talk about that because I would really like to talk about that. But be careful who you're watching. Be careful who you're influenced. Who influenced you? Always, it's always better option in most cases to listen to parents. Parents know much more than we content creators. So listen first to the parents, then others, okay? It really depends. If your parents are not good, that's another story. But I'm just talking most cases. Parents know what's the best for you and they want the best for you, okay? I know we went now on a little bit different route, but I, I found this a great chance to talk about this. So yeah, be careful who you're influenced by and my goal as being a content creator is that I influence you in a good way. That you're a good person, that you have a good mindset, that you do good to other people, that you don't scam other people, that you don't do other crazy stuff what we currently have on a YouTube scene. So just be careful about that. Okay, uh, what else did I want to say? Again. And the Judgment Virgil is my favorite character, and it, it will always have a special uh, place in my heart. I mean, overall, Devil May Cry Peak of Combat will have a special place in my heart. And who knows, I might be back. I might be back, you never know, but currently now, this is a farewell, and there is a really low, low, low chance I'll come back. Maybe Anniversary to cover it for fun, but just maybe. Uh, if they add new story, if they really, really start uh, doing crazy good, I might drop, I might go back at the game, but that won't happen. I already know that. Uh, it's a fact they don't have much money to invest in this game because of the revenue they have. All Devil May Cry games, China, all of that, they all shut down and this will shut down. Okay, it's just a matter of time. I believe they, they, they will squeeze the content until first year anniversary and then after that possible shutdown and that is my opinion unless the things turn around of course all of that is subject to change but that is my final thoughts and hopefully i did explain everything wanted what i wanted to explain correctly okay guys with this we're gonna end the video i just saw i'm talking for 14 minutes <laughs> which I didn't even know. So hopefully you did enjoy it. Again, I'm here for you guys. Join the Discord server. Um, I'm making like content on many games. So if you enjoy my content, even it's not, if it's not Devil May Cry Peak of Combat, I advise you to check other content. I'm the same on, on all of the games, but for sure, one more time I wanna say, Devil May Cry Peak of Combat, especially the community that watched me, will have a special, special place in my heart. Okay, with this, we're going to end the video. Hope you did enjoy it. Leave a like, subscribe, and yeah.
farewell, Devil May Cry Peak of Combat. See you, maybe in future, who knows. But until then, see ya. Bye guys, love ya.